Yes, here sir. We are back. <laughs> back. It was on a little hiatus last week, but we're here. Bad yeah, we're like here, we man. Bad like we never left. Bad like we never left. feeling? Little fucks. Feeling better, man. Feeling better. Hey, it's been crazy, crazy weeks, boy. Like, that ain't no... Understatement. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We'll talk about it another time, but that. I don't with you, bro. I don't with you. That, that, that's no joke right there, for real, for real. But yeah, man. Yeah, you better stop playing with these folks. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> everything cool and couple stacked, though, man. How y'all doing? Everything, everything, bro. I can't complain about nothing, bro. Everything, everything. Same shit. It been a, it been a cool little week. Cheyenne on dropped another playlist. I was vibing that thing on the way here. Mm, Yo, mm, I was listening mm, to that shit mm. in the morning. Nah, you got. <laughs> You said what? <laughs> I missed it. What, bro? I definitely missed it. <laughs> Me too. But oh. don't you got them vibes on? I oh, asked thank for you. Last night too. You had the party rocking too, Shane. Thank you. You want to thing I ain't feel like DJing, so mm. I know. My people got me, mm-hmm. so that why you know that why I called you back to back like that. It's you know okay. what I mean? I ain't want to be on no stalker shit. <laughs> no, by the second time I was like, oh, something's important. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let me pick up. That, yeah. It's always the second call. So bro. you like, really just eared me the first time. You was on date again, huh? All right, bro. No, I was in the middle of talking to my dad. Oh, okay, okay. You can't come back. From yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> Respect. Yeah. yeah. God, God bless. You gotta, you gotta hit him with a God bless on that one right now. <laughs> Yeah, 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 yeah. Appreciate it, appreciate it. I'm yeah. glad y'all like it. No, nah, man, you got, I don't like up. every last one. No, you really should be getting paid for it, Queen. I'm, I'm just throwing I'm it out there. It. Yeah, that check coming. Yeah, it's coming. That check it's coming. It's definitely coming. I'ma just throw it out there. Check up. I saw you had a shot glass or something. Mm-hmm. Those like yo's for sale or you got more? Plug. Yeah. Wait. I was I was trying to do a little. Oh, you the little round does, but yeah, oh, I have. Um, no, you good? I got shot glasses. Um, I have some candles coming, and I'm waiting to f- do my roller trays, and lighters, and ashtray and grinders. Well, well, I mean, break, hats, down, break down the candle for me. Like, what's the what's the the scents? So yeah. the scents are gonna be based in groups, obviously herbal tea and whiskey. So um, herbal, we got lavender and chamomile. Um, tea, we got a mandarin and. Mandarin and papaya, or something, something along oh, those lines. That sounds tropical. And then the um, whiskey one is gonna be a coconut, ca- coco- cocoa butter cashmere, for the whiskey. Well, shoot, I need all know. three. How much <laughs> they going for? <laughs> let me know. So I'm finalizing them now. So as soon as I get all the deets, what you think is gonna be? Get them. Hmm? How, how much no, you think gonna sell them for? Oh, oh, I don't yeah. know yet. She, I haven't she, figured that she's out. Figuring it out. I just need a little party pet one time. You got a little bundle plan? No, I do. So I want to. <laughs> yeah. no, I'm gonna, right. even, eventually, I'm going to get to doing like boxes of, you know, just the shit with a little hey, sticker. We'll, we'll, little. We'll, 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 the, the, eventually, down the line. You got to do the, the 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 pack with the three candles and the vinyl joint. Yeah, yeah. That'll Eventually, that's that's we I want to get to get camera. to all of that. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Got, y'all got, cooking right yeah, now, though. Y'all, 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 hey, catching, y'all catching my vibe, but I got, yeah, I got that's, an idea. Y'all getting this just, gumbo right there. <laughs> right. Yeah, I see what's going on. I got an idea that I just just want you to like, you know. I'm just gonna tell it to you, and then you do what you want to do. Okay, with it. But fair yeah, enough. yeah, I, I like that. Respect. That's a nice combination. Thank you. Yeah, let me get like a buy two, get one free. Yeah. Okay. Oh, I love free. <laughs> so, <laughs> but yeah, so I got all that coming. Hopefully, I I should be done with everything within the next, at least by the end of October. I have sure. everything done, website up. Y'all nope. get all that shit on there. So yeah, that's yeah, the yeah. Goal. We're looking forward to that. For hey, real. yo, yeah, yeah, yeah. Welcome to the No Buffer Podcast. Yeah, oh, yeah, man. We're here. Sure, we're here, man. Sure, I'm your host, sure. last name. Good. And to my right, I got the lovely. Um, Cheyenne XO. And to my right, I have the Majestic. And it's bad. Every time you say majestic, <laughs> I feel chosen. I ain't gonna lie to you, bro. <laughs> chosen. chosen. I feel one. chosen, bro. I you might me you, feel man. special. You might me feel like God took his time with me when you say majestic. He did. <laughs> Every time, boy. I choose you. Lingo Ooh. Steve, man. And to my right, I got my player partner, the man behind the boards. Keep it, I fucks with it. <laughs> you out here blushing like how he be looking. Hey, hey, I feel like I'm coming through the, the team. <laughs> Hit that Ray Lewis right. on me one time. Oh, okay, okay, okay. <laughs> yeah, Who are you? Man. <laughs> Who, are you? Who are you? Yeah, he didn't get to that part. I slid in there. Producer Black. Oh, okay, oh, my, bad. Bad. Okay, my okay. bad. My bad, my bad. So, I hey. y'all, man. What's going on? I hey, know it, right? right? I know it, right? Culturally ratchet question. Yo. Oh, pop it off then. Pop it off then, player. <laughs> hey, what's the point of a fitted sheet? 
A who who? A, a fitted, fitted sheet. sheet on the bed. I get so that it. shit don't move off. So you're gonna be on a mattress. Right? You talking about that's the one that hook around the Yeah, What's that's the, the fitted. I don't, I don't get the point of a flat one. I, I get know. the point of a fitted. I don't know. Cause I don't been to hotels that they don't even use a fitted. They use regular, um, regular linen. And I don't mean to overgo your culture. The right. I hate throw pillows. I fuck with throw pillows. <laughs> like, oh, bro. Extra ass pillows. Yeah, bro. Like, oh, why like I got ten pillows on my bed, bro? Bro, I don't, I don't like. I, we've had this conversation before too, though. Oh, it's certain things about the bed. Like, bro, have you ever tried to fold a fitted sheet? Mm -mm. Yeah, bro, I was gonna say. Like, no, I've never even tried. Like, I've seen it. Today, I had to put a, a fitted sheet on my daughter's bed. She, you know, she got a little bitty, mm -hmm. little bitty bit. It took me about, no exaggeration, about 45 <laughs> seconds to put that sheet on the bed. And I know that don't sound like a long amount of time, but that's 45 seconds to a middle of my day gone trying to put this fitted sheet on this bed. Trying to figure it out. Using like, why? Oh, yeah, because first of all, if you, <laughs> you know you fucked up when you try to go to the other side. That's what and I'm that saying. And I don't reach. And oh, it's <laughs> And you always, every, like, mm -hmm. it's always that one time. If you get a fitted sheet right on the first try, bro. Yeah, you you like a godsend. Yeah, like, so, you gifted. Majestic. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I just had to say it again. You yeah. said they roll off the tongue. Yeah, bro. Majestic with she said, yeah bro, I don't majestic. like fitted sheets though, bro. For real, like I, I don't get feel. flat sheets. Like I, I really don't understand the flat sheet part. So you rather just have the fitted sheet, then that's it. Yeah, and a, and like a comforter. Mm -hmm. oh, I feel that too. No, like you know, sheets. there's too many sheets have to like because you end up tucking the flat sheet anyway, and it's worse because it don't have the little. The when we little say the flat right. sheet, we talking about the the it's sheet. sheet. Yeah, just a regular sheet, right? Yeah. yeah. Oh, okay. It's, it's a flat. See, so it depends on it. Like, you know. I ain't never called these none of them. Like, what I'm trying to say. <laughs> oh, you just said sheets? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I got two sheets. <laughs> right. Yeah. But see, it depends on, like, you know, the, the, the time of year. Like, if it's summertime, it's just a fitted sheet and a sheet at our, at like, our bed. We mm -hmm. won't do the comforter. Because it's kind of like, like, I don't know. It's too I mean, but it plays its purpose, bro. You don't want to be just laying on mattress. No. What? See, I'm. I, I get it. My thing is, I've been I've been to places where they'll just have a sheet. Oh, okay. Like, it ain't no fitted sheet, just a sheet. Then, like, I mean, bro, you know how there's some hotels, they their bed is everything. So, they'll put, man, I've been to hotels where I have, like, nine sheets, bro. Like, a sheet. Yeah. They have a fitted sheet, a sheet. You said St. Regis. Uh, no, they do like the. They do the hotel, like they do the. the I know you the the, they, Yeah, they do the fitted sheet. And then they do like a blanket, like a mm -hmm. little blanket thing. Then they put a sheet on. Then you got a day to get. Then you know, know depending shit. on where you. I know this shit. Hey. <laughs> I, used to, bro, I used to hate making beds, bro. Hotel oh, oh, bed. oh, okay, yeah, bro. I used to yeah. Hate they bed, they tuck bro. it some serious. No, they do, they do I, could, I definitely could do it for no job. I hate making my own bed. Facts. You ain't lying. I I told y'all about that. I I think it's pointless to make a bed. I mean, I personally like doing it. Oh, we doing have it. talked about this. Yeah. We talked about yeah. it because I, yeah, I, I feel like if you, I feel like if you make your bed before you you, you leave the house, that's how you you know start your day off neat. You know what I'm saying? With sure. some order, with I like some coming back to that you know home. Mental thing like you accomplish something. Sure. Yeah. Me, I like I, I like coming home and that shit. That should be looking so nice. But I ain't gonna lie, I, I, it is it is kind of pointless because pointless, I'm right. finna hop right back in this mother. Right. right back in it. Like I'm talking about right back in it. I I get what you're saying. That makes sense to start your day off. Your you you know you um you finish a task. You know what I'm saying. You you got a check mark in, in, in your program for that day. I get that. I understand that. That that makes a lot of sense. But like you said, you about to come home and get right back in it. Right. It's just I don't know. It's, it's it's a waste of time to me, but I get it. I understand. <laughs> what, what's the word? I digress. Wait, respectfully. <laughs> that shit's stupid. Respectfully. <laughs> How was our weekend, bro? Uh, and and mail. My shit was straight. Oh, I really? Home with my what dad. This week? I saw. I saw you. With my dad, surprise, he cooked. Surprise, that shit was um, delicious. Yeah, yeah. I pulled that up over dope. there. That was cool. Shout out to Big Sun too. Happy birthday. Happy yeah, birthday, bro. Shout out to Big yeah. Sun. Y'all can dope. stream that on Rich off yeah. of that get payola. Facts. Featuring Big Sun. He was um he was pleasantly surprised, so that was good. That's dope, man. But other than that, I ain't do shit, moved some furniture and went to my dad's, had some delicious ass uh pork chops and asparagus, mushrooms. And Still out here eating swine? No, no judgment. Yes, yes I am. <laughs> no Respectfully. Respectfully. <laughs> 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 you ain't, you ain't eating the swine, bro. Bro, you know I don't 
Uh, when last time you ate chicken? You ain't chicken with two years. No, I've been, I've been, I've been on the chicken. I've been on the oh, chicken. You came oh. back? I came back. Hmm. I came back. But, but now I'm, you know, because I took that much time off of it. Mm-hmm. Now it's like. It's only certain people chicken you eat. Facts. Like, you know, of course, Chick Fil A gonna get, you know. Can you taste the difference in your chicken now? I mean, I always could, cause you know, I, you know, I, I'm a chef. Mm. You a chef? Chef. All right, God did bless. you see them wings on my? Y'all I missed did. them. I did. I don't yeah. think I seen the wings. Yeah, that was Kore- those were Korean um, <laughs> barbecue wings that I, you know, I made. I yeah, them I Asian made. persuasion motherfuckers up. Yeah, that was good. I know this coming from a fat nigga, but that swine is fine and divine, bro. That's what I do I know. Ma- like Bullshit. bacon, bro. I get it, bro. Like I can't. I, that's one thing that I will like. Every now and then, I might have like some bacon, you know, on the on a sandwich mm-hmm. or something. I don't go and buy it at the store and cook it, but no, nah, you had that shit to itself. Oh my god! Especially mm-hmm. you do it right, put it in the oven, just yeah. Your eyes rolled in the back of your head. Just doing. That's Listen, all that. that's how good that shit she is. Like, you like sausage? Uh, it depends. I'll take bacon <laughs> over sausage. <laughs> but shut up, Steve. It wasn't even me that time. It was. It wasn't even me. It was I good. Need, I need, like, that was laugh. good. That was good. 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 The question was a setup. Well, re- only because we were talking about pork, I felt like it was appropriate. Yeah, good. Look that me loud. Hit this nigga go. That, that no, nah, it I depends laugh. though. I I'd rather have the, the the sausage patty than the link. If we talking about you like also you like Polish sausage? No, nah, we talking about breakfast sausage. <laughs> I like kielbasa sausages. I was being funny that time. <laughs> I, I, my nigga Poor. said Polish. Like, yeah. <laughs> he was eating the Polish sausage. Polish sausage, yeah. A little yeah. kielbasa. A little oh, okay, sausage. okay, okay. The big you like sausage? Huh? You like sausage? Nah. No. <laughs> <laughs> you don't even like the red hot joint? Hell no. Nah. Oh, I don't like, like sausage. <laughs> I don't like sausage. <laughs> I like sausage. Mm. <laughs> That's what you gotta do. You My gotta nigga do. said that quick. Like no, 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 yeah. No. What? Nigga ain't finna hit me with the hey yo. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, I ain't fucking, come on, the bullshit. But um, <laughs> yeah, how was how was your uh, week? Man, it's it was cool, bro. For the most part, like it's chilling. No, okay. <laughs> I ain't been doing that, man. In the house, bro. Just. I need another vacation. <laughs> I'm about to say you need to talk, bro. right? I'm like, I don't know. If this is a you good speechless or a bad bro. speechless. Like, bro. Bro, that shit was depressing. Bro. Do you want to talk to that somebody? Shit was depressing, bro. <laughs> when you have, when you have, and y'all, y'all will realize this when y'all have, when y'all have kids or not. When you, or, or not, <laughs> or when you babysit. But okay, so only person who got, or when you babysit. <laughs> I ain't babysat in so like, long. Like, like, well, never mind. But my dog, my dog got kids. You know what I'm mm. saying? Okay. So he he can relate to this. Yeah. When you have one child that's sick and you're trying to keep the other one from being sick, and they both at that age where you really can't keep them apart, apart yeah, it's impossible, bro. Like it's just too much. It's too much to try to do and maneuver in a space like that. Like it's just it's impossible bro so it was like it's just been a long week i'm glad that i'm here you know <laughs> this is your getaway this is definitely my bro, getaway. pull up on bro we gotta crack a beer or something <laughs> yeah, I I to press it above. yeah y'all need bro. some bro time <laughs> yeah bro yeah bro my no. nigga need a retreat I black, what you do bro i don't even want to hear no more bro i don't even want to hear no more bro. i'm glad you're here bro yeah bro <laughs> bro you gotta understand like i, I had to beat the bee sting joint like so i'm dealing with all of that Bro, like I'm legit. Dog, uh, y'all, y'all ain't even gotta go nowhere. You just need to pull up at this nigga garage. Bro, a yellow jacket tried to take your boy out. Yeah, I see that. Angle, no, your bro. shit was bro, swollen. Like, like, yeah. He tried to take me out, bro. Like for real. Your for real, shit look bro. like bit mama's house. Listen, angle, boy. cooking some mean collards Man, off yeah. the strength of saying, looking at it. I ain't never been had an allergic reaction to any like bee thing. You need to get in that prayer closet. Bro, like, that girl, like, like, imagine waking she up. Get real for my man's out here, man. Yeah. Ooh. Black, what you do this weekend? <laughs> hey, he had to throw the team gonna, out there, hey, bro. Go ahead and say this. Bro. All right, go ahead, bro. Like, go ahead, talk. bro. And I know we don't talk a lot of sports, but you've been in. The oh no, that shit so was know, funny. You know what's going on? <laughs> that shit was funny. If the Falcons don't make a coaching change within the next, I'm gonna give them two to three weeks. 
I'll have no more faith in this football team whatsoever. Oh, okay. Like at this point, bro. You ain't got to be all that, bro. No, 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 hear me out, bro. <laughs> Don't be so crazy. At this point of the game, <laughs> Dan Quinn is equivalent to Tony Romo in Dallas. He had to have something on Jerry Jones. Like, he got something on Arthur Blank, bro. Ain't no way you're supposed to have a job right now. At this point, I think Arthur Blank ready to sell. <laughs> Arthur Blake tried to get, he tried to cash it. He tried no, to cash he, it. His he, chips. He can't do that because he got too much tied up in a Mercedes Benz, bro. Man, he can get out. So it's a will, it's a way, boy. It's something in that clause in that contract. He, make some he tried to get yeah, up out of there, boy. Shit. I just it, it's hard being a Falcons fan. At this right point, now. he got to think about his health, bro. <laughs> you can't watch the game, bro. Hey, look, I know my boy be about to have a heart attack the last two weeks in a row, bro. Here's the thing, though, and I wish I wish my dog was here so so I can talk to him. I told myself I just want to talk like, to him. I went watching the game this week. I told y'all like I, Oh, you didn't. This is a choice. Okay. I chose to do better, right? Okay. So he did that and I'm looking like okay. I know what he's talking about. So what I do, I fall in trap, let me cut on the game and I watched it happen right there. I was like, you see? I ain't had to do this to myself. I could have just went ahead and did something else. Toxic. You know what I'm saying? That, exactly. They toxic, bro. <laughs> the Falcons are toxic. Well, I tell you this, though, good. As I look around the room, I'm the only one with a uh, winning record around here. That's Everybody fine. else in the slums. <laughs> <laughs> That's fine, bro. Niggas is in the slums right this motherfucker. God bless, bro. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> bro. Everybody's no, so sad. Bro. Silver line, and we got the Atlanta Braves versus the Cincinnati Reds, so we're gonna find out who the real the playoffs. Yeah, yeah, first round playoffs. I wish we could. I wish I, I the fans were able to go to that. Yeah. I know that bitch would have been rocking. So that's I ain't know y'all were that good, bro. They went on they, the run. They went on the oh, run. Yeah, they went on the run. Weeks. They were trash all year. No disrespect, yeah, but they were nah, trash they all year. Word. Like it's all about end. it's all about clicking at the right time. They, clicking. Bro. they are clicking right now. They clicking. I eat Miami Heat. They clicking, bro. They clicking. I still got the Lakers in in five. But we ain't gonna hold you, Shane. Yeah, Black, what you do? No <laughs> oh no, you good? We'll I got talk, all my we'll laps over, over the group text. Like that. It was a, it was a chill weekend for me, uh, for the most part. I was chilling. Okay, okay. Oh, that means he got into a lot. Yeah. <laughs> no, I was chilling. You yeah. know what I'm saying? And, <laughs> and he kept it off with a smile, bro. <laughs> but he kept it off with a he, Kool-Aid he, smile, he was, bro. He was, he was remembering. The, it was a chill weekend. <laughs> was chill. He was recapping it in his head. head. <laughs> <laughs> Somebody got us a cutty. <laughs> <laughs> you read the books, novels. Yeah, Somebody no, got us a cutty. We played that herbal tea and whiskey. Was so funny. Do nothing. <laughs> Grin. <laughs> it was chill. Grin. No, he had the Kool Aid smile, bro. Yeah. No, that's better than the Kool Aid. What's the dude they, uh The Grinch smile. <laughs> oh, that, yeah. It was the slow roll too. Yeah, too. You're right, bro. It was a slow roll. It was road. chill. Slow roll. It was a slow roll. <laughs> yeah. He did yep. it all. That's all. Hey, bro. Respect. Uh, Sunday. Watched a few SEC games. Got some work done. You know. Oh, word. something like it's crazy word. though. The SEC play on Saturday, but you said football Sunday. No, so yeah, I mean, both he got guys. lost up in it. <laughs> <laughs> they kind of went together. Yeah, they linked together, bro. <laughs> the, you know, the festivity you know, started Saturday well, and then Sunday. When they say Sunday. funny how yeah. time flies when yeah. you having fun, yeah, yeah. I got yeah, it. Yeah, my boy probably didn't go to sleep. <laughs> <laughs> I read between them lines. There. I apologize yeah. if, if you know if you weren't trying to let that out, but. No, I'm telling you. There you go again. Yeah. <laughs> 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 that was just shit, Steve. <laughs> <laughs> uh, my, my, my was chill. <laughs> <laughs> the Grinch grin. <laughs> Slow roll. I did, I did more work than anything, but uh, last night when people don't get. <laughs> <laughs> no, y'all gonna make me spit the one out, bro. On the job, bro. <laughs> Side eye. <laughs> yeah, enough about me. <laughs> <laughs> y'all some fools out there. Nah, but uh, but people that we had like a little bonfire type mood oh, up there. Oh, nah, it was it was pretty dope. You know what I mean? Uh, uh, vibes provided by uh herbal tea and whiskey, yeah. volume eight. Okay, shameless plug. Yeah. Thank you.
by uh, Shane XO. Mm. <laughs> Appreciate mm-hmm. it. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. With the vibe. Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It was perfect bonfire music too, bro. Nigga had the skewers on, mm. few burgers, you know, little s'mores. Oh, okay. yeah. little, little seafood kebabs? Oh, no, you said s'mores? Yeah, bro. It was oh, going yeah, down, bro. It was oh, going down, whole bro. Move. Right. It was going down, bro. It was going down, bro. Was it digital? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Of course. Good, good, good alcohol flowing. You know, when the alcohol get the flowing, you know. It's over with. Yeah. That's all you need. Yeah. Good music, good alcohol. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, you know. Good night. Oh, what's up, man? It's not like y'all really, y'all accomplish y'all goals this <laughs> week. <laughs> it was definitely a, bro, I had a rough weekend. I mean, a work, week. rough week, bro. Yeah, yeah. I'm on the job. I'm in Jackson, Georgia. Mm. The whole sliding door just comes out the hinge on my ass. <laughs> oh, <bro. shit. laughs> like, bro, That's what have y'all got it. going on, bro, with these vans, bro? Bro, the door just comes out the hinge, bro. I couldn't eat like it for for like I was sitting there like thirty minutes like trying to get it bro it was stuck so I had to call him. They was like yeah it's gonna take like two hours. To get. Bro, I'm in Jackson, bro. Like and I got a route route. Like you know this ain't no I ain't got no easy day. Like man, I pulled it like halfway in, hopped in the van from the back, and just got to tugging it for dear life. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> and I got it in there. You know what I'm saying? So but you ain't open up the side door no more. You I couldn't like I went I wasn't finna fuck around with I it. Wouldn't like. I was just working out from the back, which made my day harder. Like yeah, yeah, I'm, I'm on these fucking yeah. farms, and then so like some of the vans they got where you could go through the you could go um you know cockpit which you call where I'll you, give you some, yeah, yeah yeah you can go from where you are driving it, yeah, to the front yeah, to the, yeah. all the way to the back from inside the car yeah your van your went like that. Nah, the door was fucked up like yeah. that door was fucked up you <laughs> oh, see what i'm saying so then i got these dogs and shit i'm worried about like everybody out there got a dog oh yeah you in the woods bro. like i'm talking about free ranging though like no yeah. no, no leash yeah. none of that yeah, like worried about that. none of that brother yeah, like, none of that so you know usually Usually when them right. dogs come come to the van or whatever, they be some big motherfuckers too. I hunt about six times. Mm-hmm. If they don't come out, your shit going out the window on the grass. <laughs> you know what I mean? <laughs> I couldn't do none of that, bro. Yeah, <laughs> like, yeah. yeah, bro. Yeah, it was just I'm rough. Sorry. Yeah, right. it was rough. It was rough. Yeah. Well, you know, thankfully you had a good weekend to kind of you know even that out. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, so that's what's up. That's always a good thing. Mm-hmm. What? <laughs> 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 oh my god! <laughs> you look like you wanted to say it was like, don't even go there, <laughs> bro. They gotta find a better way, bro. Like, <laughs> bro. I know what I hate about jobs, bro. What's that? Every day I wake up thinking like this. A nigga really got the audacity to tell me what I'm <laughs> worth the hour. Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah, no, I feel mm-hmm. that. Though. I feel that. Bro, that shit bothers my soul, bro. I, I walk out the house so bothered, bro. Every day, bro. Like, a nigga can tell me how much I work for real. Yeah. No, and no. this is America. This yep. is America. Yeah, it's terrible. It's terrible. Yeah. <laughs> Meanwhile, your president don't even pay taxes for real. You for see real. what I'm saying, bro? Man. Over 10 years or some shit like that. Bro, I read, I, I read part of that Times uh, article. It's a long, it's a long read. You know, it, you got to. It's a lot. It's a lot of, bro. Like when I tell you the gist of the article from what I read, your dog legit just throw away money. Like he's losing money on purpose, just so he can. I mean, and don't get me wrong. This is a business tactic that plenty of billionaires do. Mm -hmm. Like it's it's a known thing, right? So I don't want to make this about Trump. Like this is just something that. They people with do. money do right. like you have you have a lot of businesses so you can have certain businesses that just fail <clears throat> so you can offset you know what i'm saying well you know you know that's it's, it's a miracle, i don't want to just say white people but you know that percent they, they were the first scammers bro like, nah, like that's a real scam, I knew the first bro. we be Facts. talking about people scam with these bullshit credit cards and shit they ain't folks, got shit on what well they they'll doing. pay peter to uh borrow from peter to pay paul in a second bro 100 yeah. percent. i need <laughs> to take notes Facts. So it's like, <laughs> yeah, I'm like bullshit. I need to you, take but, notes. But the thing is, though, bro, it's like, it's such a gray area with that because it's it's like either get away, it's it's like break even, get away with it, everything by the books, 
or tax evasion, then you're going to jail. So it's like, you know what I'm saying? Like, you got to know. Happen medium to you got to really. That, that ain't then that you figure out on your own. Like, you got to have professionals on top of professionals. Where they at? You know what I'm saying? Doing all of that. These folks out here getting. They invading. The bookkeepers. Yeah. <laughs> they, they invading. They invading. Hey, um, I did want to ask y'all why, why I'm thinking about it for real. Like when the uh, when the last time y'all checked y'all credit? Uh, mine was at the top of the month. Yeah, I usually. You said last night. I'm getting the emails and the tell for sure, for sure. Oh, uh, I, I check mine at, at the beginning of every month. It's usually when my shit hit. Um, it was a Tuesday. Um. <laughs> <laughs> It was a Tuesday afternoon. <laughs> but I ain't check my shit. I know my shit trash. Oh, uh, yeah, yeah. Definitely check. So, I, I, cause, uh, um, until I'm ready to, like, get that shit clear, like, pay off my shit, I ain't even been too much worried about it just because I know I got to get that certain shit clear. For sure. If that makes sense. Mm hmm. Does it? No? N- no. What you, what you at? Yeah. Like, yeah, I was going to say, it makes sense. Well, well, talk to me good. I mean, me, Uncle Good. Yeah, yeah, I, I'm, I'm good. Me personally, I, I understand where you're coming from because I, I, I've been in that position before. But you should check it for two reasons. Number one, so you A, know what you're looking at. Like, I mean, because it ain't going nowhere. So you need to know what you're looking at. And number two, just to make sure ain't nobody did something that you don't know about. You know uh, okay, you okay, okay. Be, you could be okay. messing around out here with some stuff on your credit that. You ain't even do. You ain't even do. I'm with you, and bro. It, you know what I'm saying? It can stay there. You, but, had, you had me at hello, bro. Yeah, yeah. Ignorance ain't always bliss. <laughs> but but I do want to... Uh, <laughs> I do like So here's something. This, this, here, this is an ad, by the way, right here. I'm going to go ahead and say this out loud. This is an ad. We getting, we getting shmoney on the number. Okay. Bottle. We getting a bottle next so, week. It, <laughs> and good for the hit that blunt. But go proceed, bro. Hey, hey so look. <laughs> if you do need help restoring your credit, and like that, you know, they can help remove... Judgments, repossessions, tax liens, medical bills, foreclosures, loans, student loans, late, late payment, all of that. You shouldn't interject while I'm doing the ad. Just, just how it works. Oh, you doing that? This, this yeah. is real life. So my bad. <laughs> <laughs> text credit to four zero four two one six five one five six. Once again, text credit to four zero four two one six five one five six for more information. What's, what's your um, question? Can I apologize for interrupting their ad, bro? It's all good, oh, okay. bro. It's all super okay. organic. This is how we do it. Okay, okay, cool, cool, cool. So how long, like with repossessions, mm. does that shit fall off? Um, it does. I don't know for sure, but what you can do is text credit to 404 216 and they can give you all the answers that you need. Okay. But but uh, yeah, it, it does a lot of that those things do fall off, but there is a certain time frame like i think seven years but i don't know for sure yeah i want to say seven i believe yeah oh, oh that's really all i got i'm coming up on the seven though yeah yeah so it's like some, <clears throat> a lot of stuff do fall off but you know you for one you got to know you know what i'm saying like what's on your credit i say this because i've had some things like at one point in time i had some on my credit that i knew about but it didn't have to be there if that makes sense like it was something on some like i legit forgot to pay the last bill of something oh yeah and because i forgot that. to pay the last <clears> bill or something i was like moving and it was like it, it was something like where you had direct tv in one place and the place that i moved to xfinity mm-hmm. so i'm like i ain't even think uh, it, i ain't think about it but that was on my credit like you know a hundred dollar bill it's two things i got the repossession shit and the verizon joint man That's fuck it. Verizon. i know i ain't paid that bit that bitch got to like eight hundred dollars yeah oh tch. Yeah. Yeah. A lot of that stuff. I, I settled on a lot of like. For real? Yeah, bro. Cause oh, I'll call in on it. See, I ain't want to call and not have and be prepared to pay. Right. And then now they got a hold up. <laughs> <laughs> now they on my bumper. You I see what I'm saying? I'll tell you something that happened to me. I had. I done a, came and turned myself in and I had a right, lawyer. Right. Right. <laughs> Right, right. I think right. I had like a yeah, yeah. I had a T-Mobile joint like back in the day that that I had let you know what I'm saying go go a little crazy or whatever. And so what happened once I was in the process of getting all my stuff together, I just called, and I think I owed like four four hundred and something like that. 
but you know, interest and taxes and all that had bumped it up to about six. And so I just made a settlement. I was like, okay, I'll pay it off. So I only had to pay off what I originally owed. Word. But what this is what this is the kicker though, this is what they do. So whenever you settle a certain amount of debt, mm -hmm. what some companies would do, this ain't everybody, but it's some people. Mm -hmm. Say you owe a thousand dollars, but then they settle and you only have to pay them like four hundred. So what they'll do is technically you still owe six hundred dollars. So what they do is it's a form, it's basically like you made six hundred dollars. So mm -hmm. you, you report it on your taxes as mm -hmm. extra income. Because it's okay, good. so it's technically money that you didn't you didn't earn in pocket but you didn't have to spend, so they right. treat it like you actually made that six hundred dollars. Mm -hmm. And on some grown man shit, I'm gonna go ahead and get, get on that though, cause like yeah. Well, well, I'm banking on this repossession following down yeah. now. Cause I'm on year six. I know that for sure. I was just thinking like, damn, when I had this, yeah, I'm on year six. Well, you know, just text credit 5156 <laughs> and they'll set you straight. Yeah, I'm going to I'm I'm text that because I need to get, I got to get this shit together so I could, I could buy something the next year and a half. Yeah, man, for sure. What we buying? Herbal tea and whiskey shop. That's what I'm talking about. What you buying? <laughs> <laughs> nah, I want a tea shop. Word, oh, oh, word. Tea shop. That's yeah. what's up right there. Word. Mm -hmm. For sure. yeah, yeah, it's, it's time to boss up, now. That's what it's time to do, man. That's what it's time to do. That'll man. be dope, right? You got the tea shop. Mm -hmm. Um, Div got the coffee mm -hmm. shop. Yeah, I hit him up already. Mm -hmm. We got some, some coming. Working. <laughs> Loading. <laughs> Y'all bitches right? gotta stop with that shit too. Load what? your birthday already, please. <laughs> <laughs> well, what does that mean? The birthday load? loading, oh, like, come, on, yeah, like, come, come on, yeah, like, come on, come on, good. <laughs> <laughs> Old man moment. Yeah, bro. <laughs> <laughs> come on, <Loading>. huh? <laughs> what y'all supposed to do with these <laughs> with these iPhones? <laughs> Good be like, how you post to the story? Yeah. <laughs> what? <Yeah. laughs> hey, my dad still struggle with a DVD player. That shit is classic, boy. <laughs> <laughs> that shit terrible. Terrible. Yeah. <laughs> you said you said story, right? So here's the funny thing. I know how to all the social media yeah, stuff. Yeah. Like my wife, she don't be on it like that. Mm. She hit me up. She was like, Yeah, I tried to post, make a post on Facebook. I ended up posting to my story. I was like, oh, for I ain't have no words because I was like, I was trying to be sympathetic, but also I was you like, can't call your old lady. Oh, no point in No, no, you can't do that. You can't do that. At all. I shouldn't even like old lady. I was gonna say that here. I just want to throw that out there. Oh, you no, okay. I can't. No, I shouldn't like old lady at all. Like it's just. Okay, I ain't know that, bro. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. You sneaking it out here, bro. Right. <laughs> I ain't been unfaithful with his words. Right. Bro. But when she leave, I'll be talking again. Words, bro. You ain't sneaking, bro. Like, why are why your old lady on the show? On this bro? episode on cheaters. Yeah, ain't sneaking with his words. Right. He's sneaking with his words, bro. Oh, old man, lady. Bro. She yeah. gonna pop up here. Old oh, so lady. She don't listen to this, huh? Oh, okay, God bless. You said to we, we cuss too much, bro. She don't be want to listen. Oh, that's me. the problem. That was like tell her I tone it down, bro. Tell I know cause she talking about me. Nah, I think I had the problem. But this was, like, this was like this was like time ago. This was like when we first started. She was oh, she me. gave up quick. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> we was letting them all. And, and she was like, yeah, like y'all be y'all be cussing a little too. She out here supporting from afar, bro. <laughs> yeah. That's exactly that's yeah. exactly what she said. I just she was supporting our face card. Yeah, yeah, she like, I just, I was supporting from before. Hey, but I just, but, uh, let, let, all right, let's talk about it. Let's get some critique. What's she looking for? That's what I'm saying. She ain't our target, bro. Like, that's the one thing you learn with all this, when you content creating. I ain't worrying about no family member checking out nothing I do, bro. Hey, listen, I'm unless you're my target. Yeah, I'm not either. <laughs> like, if you ain't my target. You could just not listen. Like, that's cool. <laughs> that, you could just tell somebody like, oh, yeah, man, like. My homeboy, um, you know, my friend, or uh, my 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 nephew, whatever, like he do this such and such. That's all. Like, that's cool. But you ain't got to. Well, I'm gonna tell you what my man say. I want the world, bro. <laughs> that boy Scarface said it best, bro. The world is mine. The bro. world, I want the is world, world, bro. Yeah. I want everybody ears. That's dope. That's dope. I respect it. Except my mamas. <laughs> <laughs> Said, you know what? I'm a saint, but she'll faint on my ass in a minute now. <laughs> right. Oh, I didn't raise you like this. <laughs> they ain't raised you like this. Right. Who are you talking to? Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. I ain't talking to nobody. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. But yeah, man, that's 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 funny. I ain't raised you like this. <laughs> she hit me some shit like that for real. Yeah. My folks are tuning in to some stuff. 
my mom, I was talking to my folks the other day, and my mom was like, yeah, so um, I was listening to the album, and you know, I ain't even, I ain't thinking about it. <laughs> <laughs> Bro, Black always give me this lip ass mic, bro. <laughs> Damn, bro. That joke, that joke, My baby. shit had a slow roll to it, too. A <laughs> <laughs> slow decline. Nah, that was that one where you seen some down there you ain't like, boy. It's a wrap. It went, yeah. it went to rolling. It went to going down like a fruit roll up. Well, I'm talking about that shit, which is crazy. Like, that one ain't here for me. <laughs> She'd be like, what's wrong? Mm-hmm. Don't worry about it. It ain't you, it's me. <laughs> I had too much um, herbal should, tea and whiskey. I knew it was, right. I should have had some oysters. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> right. You know, when we went to the restaurant and I told you I shouldn't have had nothing else to drink. You told me about that swine. Yeah, you. <laughs> <laughs> hey, bro, you be throwing out all kinds of That is all like. All kinds of bullshit. Now, okay, so Cheyenne, look. Uh, this, this ain't never is, happened to me before. This, this is, these, these are transparency moments. Cause every dude, every dude can relate. If a dude can tell you that he can't relate, he a bold face liar. No, no. <laughs> that shit happened to me one time. But I had to go to the bathroom and talk to myself. But I was looking in the mirror, bro. You got this. <laughs> I'm, hey, look, I'm trying to pump myself. Like I'm like, I'm too young for this, bro. Like, yeah. And when none, none, not, not enough pep talk in the world. Yo. It got no, a no, mind no, of his own for right eventually. Oh, okay. you it took more than usual. I don't know what the problem was though. It be like that sometimes, bro. You just what is know. that though? <laughs> this shit is hilarious. Let's talk about it, bro. What is I'm that, curious. Bro? Inquiry minds want to know. <laughs> this is what I think. It's your mind. It's your body telling you that that ain't for you. But our brain Gonna don't be wanting to process that. That's all it is, bro. Uh, that's facts. Cause it was a, it was a cheat. It was every time I did it. it For real? Every time. I, I had a chick every like that time. too, bro. Like, right. it wouldn't. <laughs> that one wasn't for you, but Lord said, she you saved you from like, what the pro- I, like, what the problem be, bro? Like, what the problem be? Uh, I, don't know. I don't know what it was, but I can yeah, you, just, you ain't had that problem, yeah. Oh, okay. That, that was it. They were like, they were like 24 type shit. I was like, yeah, man, man. It happened to everybody, bro. Well, I almost cried. <laughs> <laughs> and it you always, it always happened with, with, with like one of the ones you want though. Like it always happened with one of the ones. Or maybe it's you too anxious. I'm gonna say it could be nervous. Yeah, yeah, too. yeah, yeah. yeah. I think I think like got that. a lot to do with it. But I also like I, I relate to what he said though, because I had a situation where it was just like and this, this was one of the ones. It was just like nope. Talk was cool, but when it got to the, you feel me? Come on, bro. His mama listening, bro. <laughs> <laughs> got two kids, bro. <laughs> but no, like that's just that's for real, bro. That's just, it, you can't explain. It. It's just like yo, and it just <laughs> you don't be want to tell. Like I think it's really you, but I'm gonna go with. That I'm gonna take the L. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna take this L. But yeah, I think it's you every time. Mm. That's unfortunate. See, I don't like mind that. taking that L because I don't want to. Like you know, I come off a little. <clears throat> You know, a little sharp tongue, a little sometimes. So I don't want to never not be able to do that no more. Like, you mm. feel what I'm saying? So it's me. It's my fault. Respect. I don't want to kill. My company's already kind of shaking. So I don't want to kill yours in the process. <laughs> and then I can't never come around. I can't never double back to yeah, this you no can't more. Double back. You feel what I'm saying? Cheyenne, as a woman, like, in that situation, what's your, what's your retort? That happened to you? Uh, A few times, but... On some on some nervous shit or on some like not I'm talking about they in they was nervous mm-hmm. oh. like you know just like re- ready to get to it and it was it was way too exciting for the moment uh you know you just you be the confidence builder you just you got this we can do it Man, do not hit me with it <laughs> don't this. ever don't <laughs> ever bro you got I'm this. A, hey look I might fight you Attaboy. I'm a boy I might fight you <laughs> We can work through this. Let's go, team. You you no, I'm kidding. I ain't said no shit. No, like what that. you hit him with? But you no, just, you just hit him with the, like, no, it's cool. Like, you need me oh, to do something. Yeah, yeah, like you yeah, need okay, me to, you, you know, that. like you need me to do something. Or like, you good? You need you need a second? You can go to the bathroom, whatever, whatever. I'm glad I got it. some understanding too, cause I hate to be in one of them for. Like, I don't, you know, why I came up and waste my time oh, like yeah. that type no, of shit. No, no, I ain't no. never been in one of them. That's I think in that moment it there there's like a time and a and a place for some shit. I ain't I'm not that rude anyway, but 
you know, some some shit just be happy. I'm not that rude. Cause she a little rude sometimes. Why you hit her with the steel face? She a little rude sometimes, bro. <laughs> No, I'm not. She a little rude sometimes, bro. You don't believe me? I don't Here believe with the nigga, you please. Said. <laughs> yeah, she, I don't believe she now you said sometime. right now. I mean, it's a time and a place for everything. I feel like Cheyenne give a good tongue lashing, boy. That's just how I feel. Nah. Mm-hmm. Not that serious. Not that serious. Mm-hmm. Yeah, but that's, I mean, it happens. Yeah, it's an unfortunate event, though. That should be sad. See, when you get older, you gotta you gotta know how to finesse that. I, mean, you go, I ain't gonna get into all that. Somebody, mama, might be listening for real, but let's got, talk about it, bro. Yeah, I mean, you might as well listen. No me, buff bro. podcast. You gotta, handle, you gotta handle her. Oh, okay. I was just, oh, I was yeah, just, yeah, yeah. I, I thought and, you had something new for me. No, yeah, I was Young say, boy, yeah, old yeah, boy. No, just, and, oh. in most of the cases, that's usually how <laughs> you how you how they pick that back up. Yeah, you got you gotta handle her. But you gotta handle her extra though. That you gotta be extra with it. Yeah, he's but. <laughs> I'll tell you, y'all can have all that, bro. That ain't that ain't you part ain't of, butt before, bro. That ain't a part of my bro. repertoire, bro. I don't have to do butt, that, bro. <laughs> bro. I don't have to do that. <laughs> <laughs> tell you what, like it is, bro. Cause you know, ain't some butt, bro. <laughs> I don't have to. I don't have to do it. I'm saying, bro. Huh? Am I? My nigga sound Seriously, like his pork shoulders, dog. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> Capital B, man. Let's go. Let's go. Oh, okay. I'm sorry, y'all. Yeah. I can't see what y'all see. It's all good. That's how y'all be disrespectful. Ravens done took a little kick off back. That's oh, all. Okay. You know what I mean? So you know um I, mean? I know we don't um mm-hmm. we don't we don't talk about this, but it it happens, so I feel like we you know, we gotta at least speak on it a little bit. How how did y'all feel about the whole Tory Lane not really speaking on it, but speaking on it? In a song? Yeah. Somebody hit me with it, but I ain't went to check it out. Oh, it's an album? Yeah, he dropped yeah, the whole album. Yeah, it's like 17 songs. Oh, he just dropped the album? He just dropped the album. <laughs> yeah. Hold on, every song addressing this situation? I don't know. I ain't listened to it. It's addressing him and Meg's relationship, the situation that went. It's all kinds of shit it's addressing. I, I, yeah, it's like a. It's I been like, out the loop, bro. I ain't know that, bro. Yeah, it's like seventeen joints. What is it on SoundCloud? It's on everything. It's I about to say on SoundCloud. <laughs> but it, he dropped. Yeah, he like, done shot it and went straight to SoundCloud. <laughs> 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 that was. Hey, when you put it like he that, went to Amazon Music. <laughs> <laughs> You don't have no fucking sense. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you don't fell off like wet dope if you do one of them, bro. <laughs> he was on everything. Spotify, Apple Music, mm. Tidal. He's on the SoundCloud, SoundCloud, bro. Exclusive, though. Right. Hey, right. real talk. Well, I did see where... So he put up a post, right? He put up a post. It was like, to all my fans, you know, I, I, I know I've been silent, but... Tonight I got time, and then he said, nine what nine, nine p.m. Um, Pacific time, basically. So twelve o'clock our time. Okay. And so people legit thought like, oh, you about to go? You're a new rat. About to get on live. Yeah. You want to yeah, talk about yeah. it? Then the next post was like, album cover. Mm. Like I'm dropping the album, and so you know how that is. And it happened to be on the same day that the Breonna Taylor mm-hmm. verdict came back and so you know the narrative online was just like bro you tone deaf like you ain't, you know you ain't gonna speak on this and you gonna you basically your timing is bad and all of this stuff so what's being said in a nutshell he said that he ain't shoot old girl <laughs> that's what that's what i gathered from yeah i was gonna say that's where people because i haven't listened to the album so I'm, I, I don't I'm, I'm going through the comments on instagram baby. Yeah. so who shot you <laughs> <laughs> Ever care? I mean, I mean, in what you got to be careful with that, like in yeah. what capacity? I, I, I feel did. What you said. Like, I mean, those two people I don't know nothing about. I ain't got no. no I mean, that, yeah, that it wasn't okay. invested. Yeah. Like, it was cool. Like, if some, like, I did have somebody dumbass DM me, like, so do you know what's going on? I was like, fam, don't know. I nor do I care. So and I if I did, I'm not telling all the way to LA. Yeah, like, like, so I know you and Matt be hanging that out. That shit was nasty. But I was like, no, and you should not care either to be DMing somebody about somebody else's business. Yeah. But I care. I I cared enough to have an opinion about it somewhat, right, right, right. and then like 
you know, I'm going on about my day. Like, yeah. So it's a twofold question. You think you're supposed to care? That somebody got shot? This, yeah, well, like this, she got shot. Yeah, I care. I care about anybody. Get, I don't want nobody to get shot. Yeah. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, I think it was fucked up, but I, I wouldn't, like, I'm glad she's I ain't okay. ain't lost no sleep. Yeah, like, <laughs> let's like, put it that, that way. There yeah. was no I'm sleep at all. Like, the fe- like, it's like people lose sleep over this shit. Like, like Yeah, yeah, that, but that'd be people who just be fake deep and fake, like, you know, trying to get a reaction on social media. Fake hoteps. Yeah, all, all of that. All yeah. of the fake, fake dot, 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 you know, fill in the blank. You know what I'm saying? Like, I don't, at the end of the day, because we have this platform, we talking about it. But if this or ain't just coming because up it's, hap- or it's happening in pop culture yeah, with two yeah. people that are arguably probably some of the what most popular t- yeah, talk about people the right, right now. Like them, I mean, it makes sense, but I'm not. Somebody lying though. Yeah, That's somebody lying. definitely lying. Somebody's definitely lying for sure on that. And so I look at it like this: two scenarios, right? Either Meg got shot. Or she didn't get shot. But well, see, we seen her foot. That was that her I mean, foot? <laughs> was that her foot? Yeah, that's her foot. But that, I mean, you know what I'm saying that could very well not be a good surgery. <laughs> <laughs> well, it was a shot. It was a, okay, so let's go. Let, so here, here's facts, right? Let's play lawyer if we really want to. Like, go for it. Ooh. There's, there's an injury to her foot. Come on, people's court. Right. That's it. There's an injury to her foot, and she either got shot by Tory Lanez or. She got shot by somebody else. We'll say sh- we'll say shot. That's all. That's all we got. That, that's it. And it's a he said, she said. There ain't nobody in jail. So. Yeah, and they got ring cameras though. They got what? The doorbell shits. Oh. Oh, talking. About, oh, they, they got, got the video. <laughs> See, we just hearing a lot of stuff, bro. What? What? He, what he's cold? Yeah. What he's cold? What he's cold? Fax it. No, it, 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 it sounded to me like it was swept on, up under the rug. And everybody was supposed to be quiet about it, but did nobody. It sounded like it was a situation happened, and uh, it was determined inside of that car that, like, yo, we ain't going to talk about what happened, right? Mm-hmm. And then people started looking at this as an opportunity. Oh, okay. And let me explain why I asked those questions I asked, because, like, somebody was going hard at me because I just seemed so uninterested in what really was taking place. Mm-hmm. And I really was just like, bro, I'm glad she cool, like, you know what I'm saying? But that ain't got nothing to do with me. And I'm not canceling, dog, because of that. Cause I kind of yeah. like Tory Lanez, you feel what I'm yeah. saying? But I'm not, like, bro, I know people that did worse, I still, like, what's up, bro? Like, you yeah, know, yeah. so we still on good terms. Like, right. and that might be a fucked up way to look at it, but it's just like, I know it's it's shit way more closer to the best of me than that. Yeah, yeah. Is what I'm getting at. And she was like, she was going hard on me. Like, oh, see, that's wrong. We don't protect our women. And I'm like, damn, bro. Like, I was going to say that, that narrative, like, that bro, narrative. I, 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 I popped this off by saying, I'm glad she okay, bro. Like, I'm glad she ain't dying now. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, yeah, yeah. <laughs> The narrative of there's a few a few like phrases I can remember 2020 by and protect yeah, black women is definitely one, one of them. I'm like I agree, but I'm just saying like my thing is I, I agree, but me saying that some shit is is fucked up I got you. on the opposite end doesn't mean I'm not protecting black women. What I can I'm just see say, that bro. some shit what just I'm be fucked say, up. No, you you basically I'm trying to nah, I'm, 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 I'm trying to find the right way. <laughs> I'm to, to, find right to way. say you some were, bitches be lying. And good, good, good. So he said, "I got you, bro. I got no, you." No, because you care. To say, you bro. genuinely care about people, but yeah. it's just like it ain't close. It ain't. It ain't. It didn't hit home. So it's hard for you to care, care. You, you listen. You understand that it's wrong, but you don't. They don't have nothing to do with you at the end of the day. That's exactly. Yeah. Okay, there y'all go. Yeah. Thank you, bro. Thank See, you. See, collect. work, make the dream work. <laughs> well, I, well, I, I, I was gonna say, and also some bitches be lying. So. Yeah, yeah, too. Yeah, that too. Hey, what if, what if, as I say, hypothetically, it comes out that Meg was lying? What do y'all feel like that's gonna do for her career? Nothing. Nothing. Like I'm just saying, dude, it ain't gonna hurt it or <laughs> no, nothing, nothing, so? nothing, cause nothing, because it's gonna get swept up on the rug. Yeah, bro. it's just like with it, like, unfortunately, right? When it comes to men and women in situations like this. It, never, it, it doesn't matter. It's, it's the same, and this might be a false equivalency, but just follow me for a second. I think it's I the same thing going. like if a dude get convicted of a crime, a sexual crime, mm-hmm. and it come out later on that he didn't do it, and nobody cares. Right. 
It's just like, okay, cool, you out of jail, whatever. Like, but nobody's gonna like. They ain't nobody gonna. There's no consequence. Yeah, for what no the consequence woman did. to her. You know like, I mean? she's yeah. not gonna get dogged by anybody, anything right. like that. It's just gonna be like. Yeah. Well, no, I feel true. like people get convicted of them, what you say, a sexual crime. Like, yeah. Even they come out and say they ain't, like it didn't happen. Like they, yeah, it's stain. Like, like no, stain no, no, we talking about a stain Chris on Brown's the. No, 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 we're no, saying on this for the woman. For the, on the woman. Even if the woman come out and says, "Oh, I was lying," none of that shit happened. Like he's still left with but that. Well, she I don't guess, get shit. I guess I should say for the people that's like really like crucifying Tory, like the women that you know that saying women, black women ain't protected. Mm-hmm. For it to come out of that she's lying, like that's what I'm saying. Nothing's gonna happen. Like, like it happens like People that just all the time. Get quiet. Yeah, it'll just, it'll just get quiet. It'll get real quiet, very fast. And you know, that, I think like honestly, bro, we have to be careful about counseling people. Period. Like I, I get it. I understand what counsel culture is, bro. But we have to be super careful. Super or sometimes you know, shit hit the fan is you still a fan bro like perfect yeah. example perfect example like i saw my man account like polo at the uh, white house and like oh, people yeah. are like canceling polo to me it was funny you like, saw what and who? polo, polo the Don. Don was the, it, he took a picture with trump like on his own phone it's it's hilarious to me from here to Carolina? yeah <laughs> ben, yeah that was a bit it might be here to Carolina. yeah so but you got people like legit canceling polo the done right now right and my thing is, it's a picture, number one. We don't know what the conversation was about, number two. Like, you can, it, all of this stuff, like, and I get it because Trump is just at the top of the conversation where everybody wants to counsel him. But, bro, like, we have to just, we, we so quick to judge people and be ready to cast people away and don't have no information on it. And that's the stuff that be pissing me off. On some devil's advocate shit, what, com- in your opinion, hmm? from like, your perspective, what conversation you think will possibly be appropriate? Well, I ain't gonna say appropriate because it's your fucking life. But <laughs> <laughs> facts. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, necessary for you to be having pictures and shit. For with you to Trump. feel comfortable enough to take yeah, pictures exactly. with him like that. So for me personally, I would never put myself in that position because I know the character that Trump has showed me. Mm-hmm. He all about the photo op. Mm-hmm. He want to do that because it, it puts him in a place of justifying who he is to people. Mm-hmm. Like, oh, I'm with, I'm, if you listen to the video, the rap, 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 Atlanta rap producer, Pola, po, Pola, <laughs> the, the Don. Don, they called me, me the you Don. know, the Don, mm-hmm. Don King called me the Don. Like, he don't know who that dude is. Somebody right. put in his ear that this dude is here, he, this would be good for your, your black voters. To say that, you know, you got a picture with Polo the Dunn. Right. That's all it is. So it's like, for me, that's why I wouldn't put myself in that position. So I don't know, to answer your question clearly, I don't know what type of conversation that could be had that can be justifiable. But uh, what I will say is, I don't know the conversation that was had. So I ain't quick to just counsel somebody because right. they dare. Like, for all I know, he could have been there to be the person to kind of like shake, shake up the room. I don't know if he did, but you know what I'm saying? That could be a possibility. But I don't know because I wasn't there. I, I wasn't in the room for that conversation. We just got to be careful with that, bro, because the way the world's set up right now, you're going to be you gonna be doing a lot of counseling. Right. How do y'all feel that – Um, sorry, some mosquito that bit me on my no, ankle. How do y'all feel that Tory Lanez put out, put out an album about the entire situation? Like that was his breaking his silence moment. Do you feel like it could have been? Like, do you feel like it was distasteful? Do you feel like it could have been done another way? I, I don't because I think I, I thought about the Kanye situation. It's like we just want to hear Kanye make music. Mm-hmm. He's an artist. Like, I want to hear it through the music. Like, talk to me through the music. I, I mean, you. Of course, it, it is capitalism, but at the same time, he's an artist. This is how he expresses himself. Right. Even when you listen that. to like a lot of artists, like they express their pain and they stories through, through their. It be like they journal, they yeah. therapy. Yeah, like, that's shit. real. That's a good. That's a good yeah, point. So, and that's, that's what a good it, point. it just sounds like because some of the shit it just sounds like he was rambling on, but it's just like he just get his thoughts out. Mm-hmm. Yeah. And he just put the shit out like so. Yeah. No, I, I, I heard a lot of that uh, sentiment of. Oh, he's capitalizing off of black women's pain, and he shot a woman. So why are we listening to his music and all this shit? And then somebody made a point of, well, 
people capitalize off pain all the time. What makes this any different? You know, because yeah, he confessions is yeah. <laughs> this nigga whole life and chilies. <laughs> And how we get here? Social media? How we get here? Yeah, yeah, it's, it's yeah. Social, just social, social media. media. Yeah, social media. Why That's it. Social media. Yeah, I mean it's it's more. Cause man, it's definitely more. <laughs> but yeah, it, it got a lot to do with it. I want to go back to the time we had a razor. <laughs> <laughs> we had the razor phones, yeah. bro. Like, See, bro, like I know y'all y'all like to get on me about the old stuff, bro. But like I lived through a time when it was really like we ain't had no worries, bro. Like. For real, for real. Like I, I was in college when a color screen had just came out. So you know, like, come on the phone, phone, bro. That's what I'm saying. Like this oh, was talking about TV. I said, no, you ain't talking about TV. No, 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 no. <laughs> so I know you ain't talking no, about no, TV. No, no, on phones. Like, <laughs> no, nah, we like being funny. Tones, yeah. like, like it wasn't no. You still was walking around with like two, three devices, bro. Like you had your camera, you had yeah. your cell phone, and you, you had, had the a cell phone with that snake and shit. Mm-hmm. Yeah, you had a sidekick or whatever to text. Like you wouldn't even texting on your regular cell phone. Yeah, no kid. I, I definitely had, had a, no kids. I, yeah, yeah. One of my f- first phones was like, yeah, yeah, tripping. But you know what I'm saying? It was just different, bro. Like, you didn't have to worry about everything being caught on camera. You know what I'm saying? Like, So I, I was watching, um, and y'all should watch it, The Social Dilemma oh, on, Netflix. on Netflix. It's yeah, really it's dope. Good. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, yeah, it's information that we all know. Um, yeah. But hearing hearing the people that created these different aspects aspects of social media is like fucking incredible um i didn't know that though so that's who they interview they interview yeah they're like, interviewing oh, wow, like okay. pet like um like early um early people that were with the instagram team that created the like button and how mm. to get more fun, like so that whole thing but for me it made me look at just social media as a whole um even to the point of now that we have like influences and in, and in, like content creators mm-hmm. that literally just do shit on their phone all day right. and i just think that's just i mean just looking from when i had when i first got instagram in what 2012 to look at it now just the way we even put out content or pictures and just little shit it is fascinating to see how far we've come but yeah. then like how disconnected we are just as a whole with people like yeah. it's 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 cool but that's a good documentary to watch y'all should watch it i'd be thinking about that too though like like how we all everybody in here we pretty much talk to each other offline like you know what i'm saying we don't have to we still communicate yeah you know what i'm saying <laughs> so it's like when you have it's just weird to me when you can be in in rooms with people or be around people and be like Yo, I know them. And then you have to rethink, like, no, I don't really know them. I'm friends with them on social media. Right, right. So you feel like you know them, but right. you don't really know them. Like, I've ran into people all the time on that. That's not what you think about, bro. Oh. But I'm just saying, like, <laughs> no, I've legit ran into, like, people who I just only know on social media. Mm-hmm. And then you be thinking, like, yeah, it like, be awkward. If I at this moment, like, like are we like, friends? Like, like do no. I know you outside of social media? Or we only know each other through Instagram. Yo, like, it was a few years ago. Uh, matter of fact, with that here, what was this shit called? Two five five. It was two five five. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Five, yeah, yeah. Oh man. <laughs> <sighs> outside. <There> we go. <laughs> so, yeah, I know. I'm right? standing in his line, and so uh, my dog, he see that girl looking at me or whatever, and um, he over here, he be like. She was like, I think I know him. And he was talking about him. Like, what do you mean you think you know me? Yeah, yeah I'm saying yeah. you know me or not, bro. Or are you going to speak or not? Yeah. Like, you know yeah. what I'm saying? Like, you said, talk to your friend. Like, I think I know him. This social media shit weird. Yep, that's what it is. I'm going to say somebody, I was at a, I don't happen to remember that. I was like, Cheyenne, I was like, first of all, it said Cheyenne XO. And I was like, whoa. <laughs> that's your tag. <laughs> <laughs> right. I was like, all right, oh, and it was like, yeah, and it was like, yeah, you know, on um, Steve, my homeboy, y'all do the podcast, and then I was like, oh yeah, yeah, it's like, who this was? I don't know, I forgot. <laughs> yeah, I forgot. The fake, like the people I know, <laughs> shut up. High school shit, but I, and we friends on Facebook, but they got like a different name. So oh yeah, girl hit me up, and she was talking to me. <laughs> That's so I couldn't funny. think of her name because her name was some other shit. Yeah, I could not think of her name, like, but I, it was regular shit. And I'm like, damn. I definitely yeah, they changed their name and shit. Like, and yeah, you can't I, think I of their name. Yeah, you know them, like, <laughs> but you can't think of their name. That'd be rough, bro. especially you ain't seen some folks in like years. Yeah, yeah. 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 Damn, bro. 
Yeah. Feel like, bitch, I know your name, not Lauren. Yeah. <laughs> or or it'd be something like completely made up that you, but it's like that's all I got. Nigga, to your go name on. is Thomas, bro. He right. trying to hit me with <laughs> Skrilla. <laughs> right. Right. Skrilla Mac. Right. Yeah. Yeah. Like, hold on, fam. Like, yeah. No, no. So that, that throw you off your equilibrium. Like, damn, what is this nigga name? I know him though for real though. So like, you don't want to ask like in the conversation. Like, damn, what's your name again? I'm trying it's to like, think. You know this person, like you feel me? Like you know, it's just like down the line, Cheyenne. <laughs> you figure it out. Yeah, yeah. Like, I see Cheyenne, like, or she changed her name to something else on Instagram. And I'm like, damn, what's your name again? <laughs> <laughs> Yo, nah, I ain't gonna say it on here. <laughs> so you might as well. Nah, nah, hell no. Nah. So I, I got some people who I went to high school with, right? And the only thing that I can say respectfully is that. They they ain't who they they are not who they are now. They were not who they hold on. Get it ba- right. Back in high school, they were might be considered lame or you know what I'm saying. It just, they they were not who they are now. That's mm-hmm. what I'm mm-hmm. trying to say. And but I see them out now and I see them around and it's just like yo like I don't get it. it it's, it's like, <laughs> I, and I understand how people grow. You feel me? I'm about to say, bro, let people grow, bro. <laughs> no, no, I understand, I understand how people grow. But, but in what like, way do you think, like, it's, like, they is cool it awkward? They're cool now, fam. Oh. Huh? Like, they living out the dreams that they might have back in But I'm saying, bro, it's no, like, Bro, you yeah. know what I'm saying, Lingo. You know, hey, no, 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 no. <laughs> I, get, it, I get where you come from. Some folks turn no, into no, no. a swan after you. <laughs> it ain't that. It, it's not that, right? Okay. So, uh, so I'm talking about like you had some people you went to school where you knew they were gonna be like excel exceptionally well, mm-hmm. like academically, uh, athletically, all of that. Like you know, you you know those people. You look at them and be like, bro, you got your head on your shoulders, right? I know you. You know you going to school. You smart. All of that. All of those things you can kind of kind of project. And I know we're talking about high school, or whatever. But it's like some people I see. I'm like, fam, like that. That wasn't you. Like their 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 whole lifestyle is something. It's like the dude who becomes. It's like Drake, not. But you know what I'm saying. Like that's the best way I could put it. <laughs> it's like Drake. I'm saying, and I'm saying this respectfully. Okay, but <laughs> I'm saying this respectfully because I understand it, people it, grow. That's how I'm looking at it. <laughs> this how I'm, I'm trying to be it. respectful, bro. But you <laughs> know what I'm talking about. It, it, I understand. You know what I'm talking about. You don't have to be the same person you were five years and, ago. And that's bro. what I'm saying. I'm but not, ten years ago, I'm bro. not saying that. That's it, not you, the part. That's not the part. Like, is it fascinating to see them live out this person from what you yeah, used to see yeah, them as? Yeah, it's, it's like... You didn't see the potential, bro. <laughs> yeah, that's funny. It's like... Oh, um, the chuckle. You have to, yeah, you have to gloss over that because he's trying to be funny. <laughs> yeah. He's trying to be cute. He's trying to be cute. Yeah. He's trying to be cute with it. It's like... Okay, it's like this right here. It's like if a dude was... 350 in high school and the next time you see them they like 180 you're gonna be like bro like you've made a complete like life change like this is it's, it's a complete shift mm-hmm. so uh, that's probably the better way to like or the other way around or the they other way yeah, yeah, that, no that happens more than than but it's like it's a complete like shift like yeah. it's a complete life lifestyle change it's probably the best way to put it. Well, I'm, I'm being respect. I'm trying to be respectful. But it's just, it's funny to me. That's all I can say. Why though? Mm-hmm. Let's dive. It's funny. <laughs> Let's dive. Shit gets deeper. <laughs> it's funny because it's like you can tell when people are being something that they not. And I understand that you can grow into something or someone. And so it's hard to have this because it's going to sound... It sounds funny, but it's just it's gonna like, sound like hate. It's gonna sound like hate, and I ain't trying to be hate. I'm, I'm, I'm trying to be very transparent. That's what I'm saying, though. Am I making sense, or am I crazy right now? I no, saying. I get what you're saying. But you just sound like you don't want them to grow, like. Yeah. Hey, that's yeah. what I'm saying. I don't want it to sound like I don't, I don't want like, them to it grow. It don't even sound like you don't know hate. And yeah, shit. I ain't it trying to sound that. hateful at all. It's just it's they're it's not weird. what it's you just remember what, yeah. them. But yeah, what I'm saying is, if you ain't seen them in a minute, I feel like people supposed to be. You're right. I'll yeah. leave it alone because I can't articulate myself properly. Okay. okay. So I'll leave it alone. Okay. I'll leave it alone. Okay. <laughs> I was gonna say I get I, I get what you're saying. I'll leave I, it it don't sound yeah. like because I'm, I'm really like... not trying to sound hateful at yeah. all. Yeah. Nah, it'd be it's different if you was like, what is that shit? 
I was about to say, you like you knew the nerdy kid in school or whatever, then he became a drug dealer at 25. Like, I don't see no wrong with that neither. Yeah, that, that happened. <laughs> oh yeah, I don't like I, that either. That but sounds shit, different. He had to find his avenue. He had to find his avenue, bro. He had to find his <laughs> avenue, bro. See, but, but that's what I'm saying. Over still selling mud. You feel me? You, I ain't gonna just say just selling nicks, but you feel me? You supposed to be progressed, like moved up the ladder back. I know profit. I know people making profits off this shit. Like, like. allegedly. I mean, <laughs> just, I don't want to get caught up in indictment. <laughs> shit. Oh, you right? No, just bro. starting out like. Bro, you got to find your avenue. That, I'm bro. talking about in that field. Like, I ain't saying like it's never too late to start your career at any age. I, I, but I'm, I'm not, talking about like you dipping into some illegal shit. Like when you really know better. Like that, that's like the equivalent of like becoming a gang member in your thirties. Yeah, it's like, not to me though. Know better, like you feel me? It's not to me though. Cause Why you, not? Because you're trying to make a profit out here, bro. You're just trying to find your way, bro. They, they, Becoming we, a gang member? At no, 30? I'm not talking about that. That's <laughs> what I'm 40. talking about right now. I'm you like, said that's the equivalent, and I said I disagree. Oh, okay, I got you. I got you. Go ahead. Like, I, I disagree. Like, yeah, you know I'm saying. If I want to say this dope tomorrow, bro, like, y'all like, okay. y'all can be disappointed all you want to, bro. I got, I got shit I'm trying okay, to. Okay, okay. I guess to the <laughs> point of, you got to do what you got to do. Yeah. Like, like, making it like, you flaunting this shit. Like, you know what I'm saying. Like, you know how niggas get, like, you feel me? See, that's that's what I'm trying. All of a sudden, that's what the I'm flaunt, trying to The flaunt of it all. When it doesn't look authentic is the yeah. issue. When it when you when know it. They weren't getting money before. Man. Okay, but I'm saying. Let's your ass up. They weren't getting money before. Nah, I get. They have. See, that's what I'm saying. You compare it to a situation where, where you said, well, they flaunting in and shit. Now, they ain't having to that flaunt then. But listen, when you flaunt it, that means you you being a drug dealer to be cool. You're not doing this shit for survival. You feel me? Not necessarily. Doing, if you got to flaunt it, like, if you're doing it out of, because if that's the case, if that's the case, like, a motherfucker get a bullshit job, if, say, if you had to go work at McDonald's, you ain't flaunting that motherfucker. Because it ain't a drug dealer money. It ain't, but I'm saying, you, 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 that's what I'm, you saying you, you got to, you flipping the drugs because of the hard times and situations, like, at that age, but I once hard like, times are over with, I can't goddamn work hard, play hard. <laughs> <laughs> nah, I, 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 I get what you're saying. Hard, I, I get what once I, I get, get what off this '93 Bonneville, and now I'm able to handle my bills, and I can get me a a, a, a Benz, bro. That shit, what's up, bro? <laughs> Fuck it, we out here. God bless. God bless. I can't get my Benz. God bless, bro. Damn, Do you, you be boo-boo. still riding the Butterville. God bless. Yeah. In the what? <laughs> that's like a Butterville. Oh. That's how they get caught, though. I understand. I, I, yeah, oh. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. But that's yeah. how they get caught. It's sloppy for no reason. Like, get your money, get out the way. That's how I say, especially if you're doing something that you know is a big What are you doing? <laughs> the drug. I, you know what? This, this, this brought me Bro. to something very interesting, though, bro, that I would. That I think the mind of a oh, drug dealer is something that could be taught in professional, like in colleges. How would you? Yeah. Like I think because like just the psychology of it, bro. Because like everything you just said, right? The, 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 the tricking yourself to think that you gotta. This is the way I gotta make my money. Because at the end of the day. Like, I know we, we try to glorify it. It's been glorified through hip-hop and all this stuff. But, like, for real, for real, bro, if you need money, like, there are other options before getting a drug dealer is all, all I'm saying. Like, people get into drug dealing not just because they need the money. They get into it because of the other things around it. Like, I want the... Are you saying that's the main reason? Because you're not making money. I'm not, right? saying, I'm not saying that's the main huh? reason, but I'm saying... Time, you're not making money, so I'm, not I'm saying money is not, like... You know how you hear the, the stories of like, yo, I had to sell dope. That's my only option. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like and it's really not the only option, for, but you yeah. making it that way. Like for you to get to that mentality to think that that's your only option. Well, I think them and strippers should teach classes because well, that's how they 100%. think it either. They be like, oh, this is the only. I mean, it's, it is the, it's the only way to make that much money fast. fast. If, that's, if that's what you witness... And that too. You might think that is your own right. <coughs> but I if you, ain't, but even if you ain't witness it, if I'm, you, I'm, you mean like growing up witnessing it or yeah, just? Yeah, I'm talking about. It ain't necessarily to be like your. It ain't necessarily be in your household okay. or you know yeah. what I'm saying. Like when in like your community, you know somebody. You just like, see it. Yeah, like yeah. You might think that's your only option. You might 
have a heart to heart and be like, bro, I'm not really this person, like mm-hmm. the like the smart guy, or I'm not finna be going out building rockets. I'm not finna be flying planes. Fact, or, fact, fact. You know what I'm saying? Like mm-hmm. you yes. might think that's your only option. You right. Like, I'm not finna go work at Kroger. Right. Like I'm not finna go work at Target. Like But but see what I wanna get into is to get to that point that you thinking that you're not you like you thinking that I'm not gonna go like you just said, I'm not gonna go and work at Kroger, I'm not gonna go work at Target, like what clicks in the mind to make you think that I, that's not an option for me? That I gotta go this way. You know oh, what I'm saying? Because I mean, it's a lot that plays in that. Like our school system suck. Yeah. True. <laughs> you dig what I'm yeah. saying? Like, uh. So if you ain't really making no shit academically, and you ain't yeah, got no you, sports scholarships, it's hard to even see that. Like, yeah, it's over. Have that foresight. Like, yeah. I can get here by doing this or right. doing right, that. Right, you right, dig right. what I'm saying? Right, right, like, right. this is what I'm saying. This nigga is getting. Rex every right. week. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And you can go and do a nine to five, but like if you see a nigga that shit bringing in what you doing for a month in a day, that, yeah, I was that, that was sounds interesting. Like, I, I want to see that play out. So it's a lot of things that we do that really, I mean, might not make the most of sense. Like mm-hmm. the strip club doesn't make sense. At all, we talked about this it too. I definitely think. don't. Uh, maybe I think but we ba- barely touched on it. Yeah, the strip, yeah. The strip, the strip club doesn't make. Yeah, I think we were talking about like buying sections and yeah. shit. Yeah, I yeah. mean, but None even that even to that, dude, yeah, don't. Yeah, no, I feel you. You it's, see what I'm saying? Yeah. But if that's what you saying, matter of, like, oh, uh, if you saying females is fucking with the niggas who got the sections, you want to go get a section. If you ain't get them off muscle, so it comes back to the woman. Oh, women rule the world. Right? Technically, yeah, <laughs> shit. But I'm just it, it's power just, that pee. It's just That's amazing, bro. Is. Like when you really strip all this stuff down and like really break it down with it, with it really ends up being the root of shit. Yeah, like the root, bro. Like that's crazy. Cause like you said, like when you really think about going to a strip club, like the thrill of a strip club is there because you you surrounded by you know beautiful women, alcohol, good food. If you had some, you know, some spots, but like. You legit can have all of that in a private setting of your own. At your house. No a nigga all like, easily though. No a nigga all with a better outcome. You for s- real, for real. <laughs> you should say uh crack in the eighties in Miami. Mm-hmm. He said, How you gonna tell a nigga like the, the minimum wage I think he said it might have been like two or three dollars or mm-hmm. some shit like that. You're not even making a hundred dollars a week, bro. Like, you know no, what I'm saying? You, but you, you tell this man he can get eight hundred a week just by being a lookout. Like, and if that's been passed down, yeah, yeah, there you go, passed down. It, it, I, I know this. I know I've been a lookout. <laughs> I'm making eight hundred dollars a week. That that's good for the crib. Yeah, right. Yeah. No, that's a good point, bro. Um, rest don't in let peace me to and my follies. brother be doing this shit or something. You know what I'm saying? Like, we so, good in the crib. Oh, rest in rest peace, peace follies. to follies. All right. Yeah. Sad. Boy, COVID out here, boy. Killing it's rough. It's, it's rough. It's, it's rough. It's taking some business. The strong boy. will survive. <laughs> <laughs> it's rough. Huh? What? It was something else to shut. Oh, no. Nah. What, music the room? Music it room? was something before the music room, I thought. Shit. Another Edgewood. landmark in the city. Edgewood, Edgewood period, down. yeah. Started with department store. <laughs> Two chain just put some shit over there, didn't he? Didn't he oh yeah, yeah he, he bought, bought out. Mother. Oh mother, mother, mother. 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 yeah. What, he he, a restaurant, a taco spot, or a uh, seafood spot. They're it doing a seafood. seafood. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Shout out to them. Shout out to Snoop and um, and Two Chains. Slutty Vegan just went over there. Yeah, Slutty oh, Vegan's over there. Mm-hmm. Yeah, there's some people out here prospering now. In the Yo, this shit been sucking and all that, but it don't have me. You know, I have a whole different outlook just on life. Yeah, one shit now. You know what I'm saying? Like talking about COVID as a whole. Yeah. Oh yeah, 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 for sure. No, All this shit, it. like you know, what I'm saying, just being able to cherish shit. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. No, like you real. take for granted, even just y'all, like being able to come in this yeah, fucking here like, and, you know and what record. I'm saying? Like, I'm genuinely happy to see y'all. You dig what I'm saying? Yeah, like, yeah. and not to say I wasn't at first, but it's like. That's just routine, almost. Yeah. yeah, you took it for granted. You dig what I'm you, saying? That, that's yeah, what it you is. took it for you granted. You take it for to granted. Me, this podcast and shit be like therapy sometimes. Like, for yeah. sure. Talking shit out, like, yeah, one hundred percent. We just had a therapeutic moment with me, bro. Right. <laughs> Lego was like, bro, are you all right? <laughs> 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 I had to realize right. I probably wasn't you not okay. You know, it's okay. Like, oh my. Mental God. health check in. Yeah, yeah. We, we got to start doing those more often in that group. Yeah. Thing. 
moments of shaggy. Balls of a bag dad on a nigga out here, bro. It's 2017, it's like it's Monday night football, man. It's looking bad, huh? Chiefs up 2017. Yeah, Fuck they killing. Fools, man. <laughs> what they up? I can't hear you. 2017. <laughs> bro, y'all don't have a winning record, bro. <laughs> <laughs> With the pinky, <laughs> and that's I'm finna go on record, bro. I'm convinced you might not see a playoff victory in your lifetime, bro. You don't win it 29 years, bro. That's I'm convinced, bro. How many times you been to BBNT Stadium? Huh? Huh? Once. And you a fan? Yeah. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> subtle too. Yeah, real subtle. Okay. okay. <laughs> I'm not going in the winter time. Like I, I'm being like fall, early fall. Yeah, and then I caught them down here twice. Then who they played? Temple. Stop playing with me, bro. <laughs> How you become a fan again? Huh? How you become a fan of the Ravens? That's what was going on in my household. You know what I'm saying with Ray Lewis and all them and how that stout the defense was. That's how it happened. You know what I'm saying? And they had swag and shit. You know what I'm saying? And I grew up a Cowboys what, fan. That's what like was that. just going on. Respect. I mean, my pops fought with the Falcons still, but like me and my brother, we was just on the Ravens. Like, yeah. And I was just fucking with them. I want room for the Falcons. <laughs> Facts. My pops was shit. Right, I'm not a fan that of what? That was what Mike Vick though. Everyone. No, I, I'm a fan of Mike Vick. Cause the Ravens, what they came in, what two thousand one, two thousand two, or some shit like that. The, when they when they won, no. Uh, oh, no when did they start? Cause they had new. When they I got when I got on, it was probably like oh three oh four. But now remember, they they came. They were the Browns at first. Right. Like when the Browns, yeah, they basically started a new franchise, and, and the Cleveland Browns left and went to Baltimore. I'm a fan of Mike Vick. Yeah, I they brought not the be Browns. A fan back. of Mike Vick. Mike Vick changed nah, my city. I thought because I thought the uh, I was gonna say the Hawks. I thought the Falcons were pretty good during that time. Jamal. They were, they honestly always been mediocre. And Jamal Anderson, what was that? That was before. That was before Vic. I'm just not a fan of mediocrity. Hey, we can move on, bro. <laughs> we don't we don't have to stay here. <laughs> All right, I mean, shit, y'all what came at my top? Say that score again. I'm score. Hell, sorry, team, you got. Black somebody you don't want to get to argue with. <laughs> no, no, not at all. He not just go all. calmly, just walk. Oh, he wasn't, he wasn't them cynical. Yeah, <laughs> like bro, why you, why are you still smiling, bro? Like you ain't mad yet. No, no, everything cool. <laughs> them the ones you got to watch out for. <laughs> he got it on him right, right now. now. <laughs> like he ain't got to move for shit. I'm waiting for Look, he ain't got to. Hey, that's what it is. Like, the people like that, he ain't got to go get it. He got it on right now. He got or it he right a, there. A triple black belt with some. Mark, right, Nick, he got Mark some Lock. other shit going on. Yeah, bro. Like you got to watch for the <laughs> cauliflower. Clocking your Adam's apple. Yeah, you, be, <laughs> you know secret <laughs> secret things. Right. <laughs> like why he still smiling? Like he ain't he ain't did nothing. He just like. Hey, I'm, I'm waiting on you. I'm waiting on you. <laughs> what else y'all got, man? I don't know, bro. This shit like quicksand up here, bro. These <laughs> folks are suffocating, bro. <laughs> bro, these folks suffocating, bro. This shit just get deeper and deeper. And they still got a whole two quarters. Of you feel what I'm saying? Oh, That's man. all, man. Fuck me running. <laughs> <laughs> hey, yo. Hey, yo. <laughs> Fuck me running? That Man. is nuts. It's crazy, bro. Damn. Unbelievable. You ever seen somebody fucking and running? That's right. Some unbelievable shit. That's what's going on. <laughs> some unbelievable uh, shit going on right I've now. Never bro. seen really no funny. shit like that. Yeah, funny. That's pretty funny. Yeah. Damn. I don't know, bro. I, 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 I'm distraught right now, bro. It's I'm always stuttering this shit. <laughs> it's time to go. Let's wrap it up. Yeah, it's, it's time. I'm always... My nigga's perplexed. How long have we been on, bud? Should have been probably an hour and 30. Oh, yeah, that's good. Yeah, that's, that's solid. That's, that's solid. That's solid. Thank that's you, guys. Good, yeah, yeah. Take us on, Shane. Hey, man. <laughs> we can skip, skip out. Hey, no 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 Take us on, Shane. No word of weed. Take us on. No book. No Fuck the words. Fuck your bro, man. Fuck my Fuck shout out. Fuck damn books. <laughs> Let's go home, bro. It's time it's now. Time. It's time now. <laughs>
Oh man, it's all good, bro. Oh that's my all, god, that's all good. I ain't mean to take my funny. hang out on you, bro. <laughs> y'all funny for real, boy. Y'all funny. Yeah. Um, uh, bro, where uh, where Block Boy JB? That's the nigga that had the shoot, the shit. look alive, yeah, and the shoot, yeah, yeah, yeah. Two of them. What, Memphis. No, that was like it felt like last year, but it was like 2017. Everything that felt like last year is not last year. That's the crazy part, cause like we ain't, we legit about to be in October. Like it's been ten months out this thing, bro. Like the year almost gone. Um, for real, for real. Mm-hmm. Bef- he got that Drake stimulus, and he good. He out of here. <laughs> before we, before we, before we check out, ask this: Why, like the up and coming artists, always shoot for? Like just straight hits, or you know what I'm saying? Like instead of really like developing themselves, there's a lot of talented people out here. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? Like cause me and my dog we was talking about like Atlanta artists. Like they're so interchangeable for the most part. You know what I'm saying? True. Like building a solid. Foundation. I mean, it's a it's a, it's a, it's a few. Come up. Huh? Yeah. They look. It's, they looking like the, they jumping in the dope game for a quick come and up. And I and I understand that because I heard baby said that little baby said that right. before. I, mean, I ain't mad saying. at it, but. Like you say, the artists that do put in the work. Because they ain't like they're going to have a... Re- this is no retirement plan. <laughs> it's not at <laughs> all. Like you about to a meal like, for the... Huh? You got to treat this shit like a career for yeah, exactly. yeah, you. Like, you really yeah. got to like work on your craft as a whole. Yeah, like It's not just some shit you just classes, like... Classes, learn yeah. shit. Yeah, that's kind of disheartening. Like, even, I even like, you know, I be giving Drake... Well, I used to give Drake a lot of shit, but... He, what, he, he put his time in in terms of like he went to go get vocal lessons. I don't say, do bro. When I time. seen that nigga doing vocal lessons, I was like, he oh is yeah, a yeah. Of he music. Yeah, he <laughs> wanted. <laughs> yeah, he wanted. Yeah, because he couldn't sing for shit. Yeah. <laughs> that nigga was in there with them little auto tunes, yeah. killing, yeah. doing his look. That nigga yeah, that shit. <laughs> pain ass nigga. I, yeah, I can't stand that, bro. That song, bro. Pain <laughs> ass nigga, bro. Like, <laughs> and then yeah, yeah, bro, and then left a voicemail. Yeah, bro. And then yeah, and, bro. and yeah, then left bro. a voicemail. That's how people get shot, bro. Shot, yeah, right. What she say? And left a voicemail. You feel what I'm saying, bro? Bro, that's I, that's toxic. I fuck get knocked yeah. off, bro. You know, fun on get knocked off number that pee and that money. Yeah. But I feel you though. I feel you on what you're saying though. Like that. That's it's a. Can we just get the halftime? I'm sorry, good. Bro. It's a. It's a rough. It's a rough. It's a rough game for for artists out here for real, bro. And especially like in times like now, artists are really feeling it. Like they legit feeling it. Feeling it ain't no. Like it ain't too many people out here like living like Rick Ross in yeah. a pandemic. Like yeah. <laughs> like yeah. Like it's hard out here, bro. Like yeah. you got artists legit can't. Hit the road, so mm-hmm. they ain't got eat. no healthcare plan. But that's what I'm saying, bro. It mm-hmm. ain't. So I, I saw something the other day, like Pusha T been in the game for 20 years. Yeah, like that's say what you want to about it, but like, bro, that's 20 years, bro. Like mm-hmm. that's a long time to be in hip hop mm-hmm. and still be relevant. Like he's still relevant to this day and, and still, still figured out, right? Yeah, figured out how to sustain 20. That ain't that ain't easy, bro. Like. Yeah. You got artists out here nowadays, but they got the lifespan of an NFL football, like NFL. Tough, right? And see, and, and it's like, where do you go after that? After right, yeah. Where Especially do you go? Having a hit song. Where do you go? It's difficult because, like, you you, and it plays on the psyche because for one, you was famous. Like, let's just call it what it is. You were famous, and now you ain't famous no more. So now you got to deal. You got to deal with that, and you got to deal with the trying to keep up with everything, like because. You got a hit, mm-hmm. like you know what I'm saying, like using the bro, like Block Boy JB or whatever. He got, he's known for having a record with Drake. Ain't no excuses out here, like you can't, you can't miss a step out here when you got a hit record, bro. So it's like, oh, that's like, uh, what's what's her face? I love Mannequin, the Tuesday joint, McCon- 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 whatever McCon- fuck his name. Is. I yeah. love Mannequin. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, <laughs> McCon- yeah, 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 yeah. You have a hit, bro. Huh? You ain't never hear him on the bro well. I did. He was like one of the early ones. Kappa done. <laughs> no, no, it was one of the early ones. You, but I'm fucking with you, bro. But you gotta hit. But that's what I'm saying. Like, like, what do you do in a situation like that, bro? Like, you legit was out. See, he here. got a file back plan. Uh, file back plan though. Well, he was. Oh, he say you have dress. Yeah, right? he do hair. I mean, but it's money that shit, yeah, bro. Yeah, it's money. That's real. Wait, like hey, he, he, he hey, cut oh. hair? Or, like he's a barber or he's a stylist? He's a uh, what? What my boy Gip say? Cosmetology, yeah, oh. but you got to look at with him if he's smart, which I think he is. You got the bag, 
now you can actually get in distribution of hair products, all that. Like, he mm. can work that angle because he actually know it. You know what I'm saying? But when you came out here and all you knew was like, shh. I'm just trying. Well, we were just talking about. Yeah, mm-hmm. I was just trying to get in. And, dog, it's, it's rough out here because, like you said, ain't no retirement plan, bro. <laughs> like, And it. And I understand certain people's, uh, what they go through is for like, say you just working at a warehouse and you've been doing music and then your shit take off. You're not ready for none of this shit, bro. At all. Somebody, you, we, even, you, you don't know what these contracts about to say. You don't true. know shit about no entertainment lawyers. You don't know shit about nothing, nothing. for real. You like, just thinking, yeah, it's hit, just they, they, them niggas showed you some money and that's it. Yeah. The whole entertainment industry I take that, really that 300000 like the dude, I've been watching Girlfriends on Netflix. My girlfriends, my girlfriends, they do they get I ain't never got to that part. My, my I just, I girlfriends. That's how it go. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> oh no, we had to finish that one. No. Hey, that, that was that's my deep, joint bro. there. It yeah. was in deep. Cheyenne rolled eyes and everything. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but look, my bad. So we, we, uh, I've been watching it, right? Yeah. And then I, I, I came up on an article about the dude William. He died. No, he ain't died, but like he ain't did nothing really since girlfriend. Oh yeah. No, he ain't. He he out here like oh, just a heart him? failure and all. Like he he had a, it was a whole article about like how he struggling to find work because for one it's Hollywood and you black. You and get two, typecast. You get typecast, mm-hmm. and then it's like it's really no job. Like he played a role that was legit equal to him. Like he ain't have, he wasn't doing no acting. Mm-hmm. Like he that's <laughs> I'm saying no really. Yeah, he, he said it. But, <laughs> no, he said this in the article. Oh, like okay, okay, the character okay. William is him. Okay. Like he's like that quirky type dude okay. who like you know like everything that that character you is. Can find him a job, bro. Oh, uh, what's that nigga name that was on the Cosby Show? Uh, the light skinned dude. Trader uh, Joe's dude working yeah. at Trader Joe's. Alvin, yeah, yeah, Alvin, yeah. Alvin. But he was, saying, he was on power. Alvin. But he was saying it's the same situation though because like a quick little scene. You know what I'm saying? Like that, you know, he was like a little job somewhere. But you can't that that's what he was talking about though. It was like it's hard to find a job and then you you try and go and do these little odd end jobs and then every day you're re- you you recognize and you you're constantly being reminded of who you were type thing. So oh, it's that hard. hurts. It's like it's Yo. psychologically mess you up. I'm sorry to do this after your bro with. Y'all seen Delante West? I was just, I was just thinking yeah. about him. When he was talking about dude, I was going to bring him up next. Mm-hmm. I saw that. But he don't been out. He, I think he um he got mental issues and stuff, too. He's definitely bipolar. And it's been going on for years. Yeah. But why can't it be changed? Because you know how, like, when they were talking about with the Kanye shit, like, they have to go and want to be admitted type shit. Like, niggas out here struggling and shit. Why? Yeah, yeah. I don't know, bro. I don't know. I saw that, and it's like it don't get better with him. It's it like don't. it's always. I seen Gilbert Arenas make a point. He, he was like, cause he, cause like there was like where his family at and shit like that, and all these coaches and players was like, yo, call. He need to call me, try to get a contact with him. Gilbert say, yo, he was just in D.C. bumming. He ain't, he's in Dallas now. Like he's nigga moving. Yeah, he said nigga moving. He said 91 bomb. He said this. No, I'm done, bro. He I'm said, done. and he said his. <laughs> 91 bomb. That shit I'm is sorry, so I'm terrible. Sorry, I'm sorry. That's true. Yeah, yeah, that's true. yeah. It's, not. yeah it's not. Fuck no. It's not. It's Hell no. Not. No. He, 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 he was savage for that one. But now nah, he, he. I feel him, though. I feel him. <laughs> he was like, his old lady is like. um. I forgot. I think she don't know like the police force or something. She's like a captain or oh, whatever. Word. Like, okay. But he, he Gilbert had the whole team. Gilbert had the team. Yeah, he had he the was like his, his wife got his money and shit. Like I'm talking about in a good way. Like you yeah, know what I'm saying. Yeah. Mm-hmm. But he has to want to go get that help. You yeah. see what I'm yeah, saying? Yeah, yeah, like yeah. why the fuck he was like hey, Gilbert, bro. He had like five posts, bro. He was like, why the fuck y'all even think he went to Dallas? He's trying to get away. <laughs> He said folks are just probably like too much in his business. Yeah. And he re- like that's what he wants to do. And then he brought yeah. it back to an article I read a long time ago about Ben Gordon. Ben Gordon go through the same shit. Oh word. Facts. Like Ben Gordon was, I read that article I read with deep. Like, bro tried to pop himself a couple times. Wow. Or hang right. himself. Wow. Mm-hmm. Um, but when he broke it, I think he's doing better, but you know, I don't think he got checked in or no shit. Yeah. But when he broke it down, 
um, he was like what sports provided for him was structure and shit, and it's just piggyback off what you were saying. Mm-hmm. Once that was over with, he is like he know what to do with stuff, and the other side gets the kicking in and and wrecking havoc type mm-hmm. shit. And now you stuck in your thoughts where you weren't even worried about them thoughts. You worried about your craft type shit. And yeah. you was like on some OCD. Now he ain't got nothing but thoughts. Mm-hmm. Yeah, now he got number thoughts. Mm-hmm. And now I can't go to sleep. And now this is bothering me. Now mm-hmm. that's yeah. bothering me. No, now real, I'm bro. just sitting in the dark for six hours. Mm-hmm. Like The mind is powerful, bro. You see what I'm saying? He was shit. like, the mind is fragile. Yeah. He was like, I'm not giving a damn about cutting my hair, mm-hmm. bathing, and all this other shit. That shit was kind of deep. Yo. He tried to pop himself. I mean, hang wow. himself a few times. That's intense. Anywho. <laughs> Uplifting word of the week, please. My word of the week is <laughs> so today was canoodle. Heavy. Okay, that sounds like uplifting. Can you spell it for me? I mean, it ain't. <laughs> uh, C A N, man, C A noodle, bro. <laughs> now I forgot. C A N O O D L E. Meaning to engage in an amorous em- embracing, caressing, and kissing. Deep. Mm-hmm. Canoodle. Mm. Mood. My book this week, man, I'm going to go with uh, Angie Martinez, My Voice. Everybody Yo, heard I heard that was super good. Not a good show. It was cool. Damn. What? <laughs> <laughs> Bro, why y'all here promoting it's cool books? Why? Bro? <laughs> like, what are we doing? Y'all here promoting it's cool books, bro. That was just disrespectful. You're supposed to say that motherfucker is phenomenal. Man, like, like, it was cool. I respect how you gonna promote a book? How you want people to read your book uh, and they cool go, "It's book. cool." Like I don't want to read it. Everybody anymore. know what "it's cool" means, right? It's cool. It's cool. Mediocrity, bro. That's and this, and it it's cool Angie means. Martinez. She some interesting stories in there. She That's talked about smoking crack in her, didn't she? I think so. It was like some quick shit. She was on the pipe. No, she just said like it just like, happened. You know, just like a one time yeah, try. Party shit. Oh, yeah. but mm. she's having a good time. It was cool. Sure, Angie y'all Martinez. check that out. You know, <laughs> if you're down for it, yeah, if, you're down for you it know. if you got time to waste, yeah. <laughs> if you're down for it, dude, I would, I would audio book it. I wouldn't read it. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh yeah, yeah. You, is she reading? Nah, it? I read it. I got the physical like. Oh, oh no, yeah. with any, any. I was you gonna say physical. Man. You must have a crush on her. Nah, I think because okay, you say you audio book. a lot, don't you? Huh? You audio a lot, audio book. No, you don't. I'm, I'm, I'm. Hard copy a lot more. Oh, okay. This was a time when I was like, because uh, I got this when I got the Charlemagne when the Charlemagne book first. Oh, came I got out. you. So this mm-hmm. is amazing time. The first one or the the first one, the Black Privilege. Mm-hmm. That shit pretty good. Yeah, yeah. I like that one. Yeah, you, any any uh, autobiography or biography, I'm doing an audio book for sure. I thought Charlemagne was a clown, bro. He turned him out. <laughs> Counseling shit, you know what I'm saying? Not even really knowing somebody, but I mean, he put himself out there kind of mm-hmm. like that to me, you know what I'm saying? But he, he got a story, he kind of inspired me a little bit, you know yeah. What I'm he saying? got a story, bro. Okay, well, uh, my shout out of the week, I got two of them. Um, my first shout out of the week goes to the fr- uh, Fry Trap. Sorry, I get a little tongue tied, I'm tired. Um, but it's the Fry Trap, um, they got. Like different variety of like loaded fries and shit. Crinkle shit be busting. Nah, oh. fuck no. Shit be busting. So, um, <laughs> and it's a black owned business. So make sure y'all check out the Fry Trap, man. They got some good ass shit going on over there. Sure I so. usually get the little uh, buffalo joints with the ranch drizzle. Shit be busting. Oh, you went out there with? I went, I don't know, it was a while ago. Oh, okay. Like, probably like a month or two ago. <laughs> <laughs> Shut up, nigga. Right. Um, <laughs> the second shout out. Oh, I finally got an Instagram page, so y'all go ahead and follow Herbal Tea and Whiskey on Instagram. So that's my second shout out of the week. And without further ado, thank y'all for tuning in to the No Buffer Podcast, the Culture Ratchet Podcast to say what we want when we want no buffer, just facts. Last name good, Lingo Steve. Producer Black and myself in the building every Monday, livehiphopdaily.tv. We love y'all. We appreciate y'all. Y'all be safe out there in these streets. Um, and we'll see y'all asses next week. We out. Ta-da! <laughs>